Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is scheduled for one fall with a five minute time limit, and it is for the Past Gen Television Championship. Introducing first, he is the current Past Gen Television Champion from Quahog, Rhode Island, weighing in tonight at 359 pounds, Peter Griffin. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is the match that everybody has been waiting for as Peter Griffin, the current Past Gen Television Champion, makes his way to the ring, as usual, full of confidence playing up to the crowd and he's got every right to be confident the past couple of weeks he had a great win over Homer Simpson he had a dominant victory over Mario last week but tonight I believe he faces the toughest challenge he has ever faced can he rise to the occasion we are about to find out his opponent and challenger from Cameron North Carolina weighing in tonight at 225 pounds Jeff Hardy. Does this man need any introduction? Former world champion, a charismatic enigma. You've got to believe that Jeff Hardy is the odds-on favourite here to become the new champion. Peter Griffin, a huge weight advantage. He's a strong man, he's a tough man. And remember, Jeff Hardy must get the win against Peter Griffin to become the champion. That five-minute time limit expires. Peter Griffin will remain the champion as the two men square off. I cannot wait to see this match. Engaging in a lockup here, and very surprising for Jeff Hardy to do that. He was never going to come out on top in that exchange against the man the size of Peter Griffin. And Griffin knocking Hardy down. Now he's come out with a very aggressive start. And this is what he's got to do against a man like Hardy. He cannot let Hardy get any offense in. He's got to keep him grounded. He's got to keep him stunned. Right hands to the head of Jeff Hardy here. Of course, you see the time limit running down here. Five minute time limit. Nice counter by Hardy. And look at this, a sleeper hold. Very rare you see wrestling moves like that from Hardy, but nice move. Oh, look at this, going to the top, looking to take a risk, but Peter Griffin's on his feet quickly. Throws him off the top rope. Jeff Hardy known for being a risk taker. But that risk did not pay off there. And Peter Griffin taking full advantage of that mistake. Nice death breaker by Griffin. Cover he's made this, you could have him here. One, Cover he's two. made, shoulders are down. Hardy just about getting the shoulders up. I briefly mentioned the size advantage of Peter Griffin when he's got such a large weight advantage over your opponent. One move can be all it takes to finish him off. Defending Hardy into the corner now. Peter Griffin charging in. All goes for a shoulder thrust. Jeff Hardy counters. Oh, look at that, sending Griffin's head right into that turnbuckle guy to take a risk once again. Jeff Hardy on the top row where he feels most at home. He overshot that move. Dive too far, missing Griffin completely. Very uncharacteristic of Hardy. Big clothesline in the corner. Oh, he rung his bell there with that clothesline. Hardy sent him to the corner, gets the shoulder thrust this time right to the midsection. What's Griffin going for here? Look at this power. Hardy weighs 225. You wouldn't think it with the way Peter Griffin is holding him above his head like he's a small child and sent him crashing down. And look at this, Peter Griffin taunting Hardy. Hardy is really struggling here. There's press by Griffin, right hands to the head. Oh, this, I, I did not expect this. Griffin going to the top rope this time. Hardy gets him, sends One. him to the outside. Is he going to go for a big move here? Going for that One. missile drop kick. Peter Griffin just stepping out of the way. Two. He's sending on to the outside here. Three. Look at Peter Griffin dropping Hardy. Chest first right into that Four. barricade. And he could have a count out victory here. Five. Referee on the count of five. Jeff Hardy needs to get back in the ring. He wants any chance of walking away with that belt. And look at this, Peter Griffin still firmly in control. Less than two minutes left on the clock. Big shoulder block, knocking Hardy down. And look at this, the big splash by Griffin. One, Shoulders are down, two. this one's over. And Hardy somehow getting the shoulders up before he could make the counter three. Very little time left on the clock here and Hardy in real trouble. Remember if Peter Griffin can just last that the remaining one minute and 30 seconds, he will win the match. Nice counter again though by Hardy. 
Has he got any time to do anything in this match? Sends Griffin into the corner. Oh, look at this. Whisper in the wind. Whisper in the wind by Hardy. That could be it. One, two. Peter yeah, Griffin's title reigns in trouble. Oh, look at that. Not only kicking out of the cover, but throwing Hardy into the air. Oh, that could have been Hardy's chance there. One minute left on the clock. Nice counter again by Hardy throwing the elbow. Big body attack on Griffin. Sends him off the ropes. Beautiful flying head scissors. Oh, referee getting in the way. And again. Hardy sending Griffin off the ropes. Takes him down. Going to the top rope. Little time left. Can Jeff Hardy do anything here? Yes, he can. One ton bomb. Less than 30 seconds on the clock. Has Jeff Hardy done enough to walk away with the belt? Covers made, the elders are down. And we have a new champion, ladies and gentlemen. What a match that was. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your winner and the new Ash Gen Television Champion, Jeff Hardy. Oh, what a win for Jeff Hardy. The new Ash Gen Television Champion. Only 22 seconds left on the clock. Peter Griffin very close to keeping hold of that title for another week. Jeff Hardy, the new champion, he will be defending that belt next week. I've got absolutely no idea against who you'll have to tune in to find out. But we are out of time here, ladies and gentlemen. I've been Jack Ryan, and we will see you next time.